my YouTube channel. On today's episode, we are going to have a Raising Kings class. Okay. All right, so guys, you know that thing I was telling you about? That this Nigerian actor, right? He had this wife, and apparently he had four children with his wife, and they've been married for, I don't know how long, but over 15 years or so, because their first child is a teenager, like over 15 years. But anyway, he has a daughter, he has three sons, and then he just told his wife this year that he's married another wife, and the other wife is a woman he's been cheating on his wife with for years, and he had a, he has a baby now by this guy, and I just kind of want to talk about this with you guys to kind of see like what your thoughts are around this. So first of all, the first question is what he did right or wrong? Wrong. Okay. Why is it wrong? Because you should have one wife. Okay. I think that is wise to have one wife, but why should you have one wife? What are some reasons why you should have one wife? Um, yeah, so you can't might not be able to provide support to both of the wives. And provide love to both the wives. You can't provide enough love and support to both of the wives. That's pretty wise, I think. So, King Alex, is what he did right or wrong? Why? Uh, I don't think it's right to cheat on your wife. I think it's a breach of trust. And trust is really important when trying to maintain a solid relationship. So, yeah, I think it's right. And... As for having two wives, it's probably not the best idea. And even if you were trying to do something like that, it's not the way he went about it isn't right as well. It's just he tries to like, or it seems like he's trying to like just force it upon her because he uh -huh, cheated. Uh -huh. And so now it's just something that she's forced to accept. It's not like a conversation he's having with her where she's where he's like trying to get her input or something. Or he's like bringing it as an idea. Like no, he's just trying to force it out on and like have this be the case. But you know, instead of talking it, talking it through or something. Well, there you have it. I hope someone is listening. Um, this is from my, my, my children. King Alex is 19. King Aaron is, is, 15, is 14. Oh, I'm ready for you to be 15. <laughs> but anyway, um, I think you guys are both completely right. I think that in this life, one thing I know for sure is that every adult is entitled to live their life as they choose. Right? Even if you want to live a life of crime, that's your business. You choose to do the crime, you face the consequences, that's your choice. But I think that marriage or any relationship that has more than one person, like King Alex said, it should be a conversation. If I enter a marriage wanting to be monogamous and somewhere along the line I change, my values change and I say, oh, now I want to be a polygamist. I have to go back to my wife and I have to talk to um, them about it. Same with me as a woman, I have to go back to my husband and say, look, I now want an open marriage or I now want to be polygamous. But anyway, there you have it. I think that for me, it's very important. Trust is very important in a relationship, but marriage is about commitment. Whatever promises you made in the beginning, you have to commit to it. And if at any point you feel like you're not able to, like you're now too weak, you're now, you know, like, man, I have to cheat on this, on my wife and this person. Talk about it. Be honest about it. And I think that, you know, people can achieve a lot if they're open and honest. But anyway, we're going to be having this segment where I just kind of ask the king's opinions of um, things that are happening in the world and just make sure that I can use this opportunity to teach them one thing or two. One thing I can tell you with this is that with relationships with women, women... Sometimes I feel like they love too hard. They love too, not very why They don't apply too much reason when they love. But when a woman, you know, when you teach, when you get her to the point where she can't take it anymore, most times she also cuts off so quickly. She can't go back. That's it. Like she's just like, sometimes I feel like I find women a little bit more black and white where men can kind of, you know, be agreeable more. The woman will take and take and take. But once she gets to the point where she's like, no more, that's it. Like, you just feel like, oh God, do I even know this person? Because she would just flip on you. And that's why. You should love my Anyway, till next time, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Mwah.